Sorry if you can't hear me over the fan noise, but clearly I've made it to my apartment and we've spent the entire day moving our stuff in and I'm exhausted, but I wanted to update you guys. Um, there's still so, so much we have to do. Um, today we built the bed where we picked up the bed, the mattress, the dresser, and other stuff from Ikea. Built the bed, built the dresser, um, and everything is just like scattered around now, and I am such the type of person that likes to move in and get everything organized as soon as possible, but it's already midnight, and my family just left like barely, maybe 30 minutes ago to go back to their hotel so yeah there's no way i'm calling it quits for tonight but there's a lot of work that still needs to be done but i'm extremely happy with the way things have been turning out um and just my living situation and all that so stay tuned i'll update you guys tomorrow with everything else that needs to be done. But for right now, I'm going to bed. <laughs> Feeling a little bit emo. Um, I just said goodbye to my family. We went out for breakfast and had some coffee. It's time for them to go back now. It's like a seven hour drive, so they had to leave kind of early. It's not like I've never done this before. Like I was at college on my own. Um, I'm a senior in college now, if I haven't already said that, but um, I've never been this far away from home. It's like, I almost like don't know what to do with myself now. I know I needed to do this for myself and it's just part of growing up. <laughs> Sorry. I never even get emotional like this. It just feels like I'm like transitioning and starting this new chapter of my life. And I'm so far from home and I'm, <laughs> I'm usually not even like homesick or like a homebody or like any of that, but it feels different this time. And it's like, of course it's like, liberating freeing and all of that but i'm in an entirely new place i know little to no one except for my roommates and a few people here and there but it's like this is a huge solo journey for me um not to make it sound like super corny but like it really is so anyways on my agenda for today I need to 
go to Target and just get like snacks and stuff. But what I really need to get is a plunger because I clogged my toilet already. Like first day in, I've already clogged my toilet. So I need to get a plunger and toilet paper. And like I said, snacks. And I'm just like unpacking today. Like that's really all I have to do. Um, and there's a lot of shit that I need to go through. So yeah, let's go to Target. I think it's been a couple days since I've last updated here. Um, I've just been like settling in obviously and like moving everything around and having everything like in its right place and all that and organizing. Um, I think for the most part, I'm like done with my room um, with the exception of wanting to get more like decor stuff, but everything that I've already brought with me is put away pretty much except for this little pile over here and like returning these bins because they didn't fit where I wanted them to go and then these were supposed to be like these like um drawer like clothing divider type things but they didn't fit in my dressers um yeah and then I have this lamp that like opens up <laughs> it's from Ikea I think I'm gonna put that somewhere like right there um but yeah everything is like it's a little bit messy obviously but um everything is pretty much done um i'm getting ready right now because i'm gonna go meet my friends at the beach but yeah i'm really happy and just like feel so grateful to be living here and have my own place and all of that I know for some people who are moving, like maybe you're moving for school or just like to new city in general, um, it is hard and it is lonely and obviously like, I think I've been here for like less than a week, like it's been maybe like four days, but um, that initial homesickness was like definitely there as I'm sure you guys <laughs> saw. Um, yeah, I'm fortunate enough to like know um, a couple people here and everyone has just been really really welcoming and really nice so yeah um i definitely know it is hard though and i like obviously still kind of have to like find my people and still you know am meeting people when school starts and all that i don't know i also don't mind the independence it's why i wanted to come out here um not so much for the distance from home because it's like a seven hour drive it's obviously going to be harder to visit now. I'm probably only visiting home for major holidays or like breaks and stuff. But yeah, it's, it'll be quite a solo journey for me, I get. Learning more about myself, learning how to navigate things on my own and being okay with that. Um, it's a little bit different. I'm noticing like it's a little bit different to experience being alone like at home i obviously like have tons of experience with being alone but i would have my family to come home to and you know dinners and breakfast and all that and so now it's like i feel like i'm truly like out in the world in a different way so it will definitely be a journey for me and I will obviously be taking you guys along 
yeah so stay tuned for more videos um i'm gonna be obviously finding my way in this new city um, i'm still adjusting i literally don't know where, any where anything is so i need to explore i need to find the spots and all of that maybe i'll make it into like a series or something i'm not really sure um how i want to document that yet but yeah it's an exciting time it's an anxiety ridden time it's all sorts of emotions that it's it's even hard for me to pinpoint what I am feeling but I am feeling very grateful and just happy um so yeah anyways um thank you guys so much for watching this video um I definitely will want to be documenting more of like the moving process when I start adding stuff to my room really quickly before I end this video I do want to show like uh, a bigger overview because I don't know if I have already so I'll just do a little quick pan through my room okay so this is the entryway I have all of my books here got a little plant I need to water him or her <laughs> um, because I have neglected that but it's this really pretty plant I don't know what kind it is but um, little side dresser bed that I need to make box fan which has come in clutch um this lamp is from ikea and my desk this is my closet i have a huge closet so yeah also this thing is a lifesaver and i still have more shoes so they're just down there but it is really nice um random shit this is all trash dresser i need to figure out how i want to decorate this because definitely i want to add some more stuff and like i said maybe put a lamp here and then bathroom oh my god ignore this gigantic bruise i don't know i don't know where she came from but yeah and then i need to figure out where i'm gonna put that but then my shower and just toiletries and stuff like that another mirror so yeah, anyways, thanks for watching. <laughs> I will see you guys in the next video.